You guys can cut each other all you want. It's up to me when I decide to let you in. I've had a woman completely flash themselves to try to get inside. I didn't let this group of guys in, and then they came back and they are throwing eggs. If you're in the area, stop by, come say hi. Just don't dress like a fucking Santa Claus or an elf. Humans are very animalistic. The group mentality comes into play on nights where everybody in the city wants to go out. You can feel it, and so you know that some shit is probably going to go down. Do you ask how my night is? Don't tell me what your dad does for a living. Their name is usually like Hunter or Chad or some shit like that. If I ask you for an identification or a piece of ID, please don't put it up in my face like I can't see. Do not talk about the weather with me because I'm fully aware that it's either raining or snowing. Don't piss on the floor. There's a bathroom. Do not throw up in the corner or anywhere in the bar and expect to remain in there. Don't walk up to me and tell me, but it's my birthday. It's literally like 300. 50,000 people born every day. What we don't like is too many guys. I think three is the max. Definitely don't throw things at the bouncer. Like a pink leg, yeah, douse or whatever it was, I don't know. It was what? Don't use me like I'm Dr. Phil. Keep it short, keep it direct. Do not try to touch a bouncer, period. Don't be loud. Nah. Yo, my man, what's up? Woo! Ah, <laughs> sorry, guy. Yeah, we're a bunch of clothes. Yeah, we're full. If you're in line, I see you. A lot of them try to do the puppy dog eyes on me. Don't do that. I've had people try to tip me a Snickers bar. And then I always like a nice compliment. Like if my hair looks extra nice, like who can tell me my hair looks nice? 99.9% .9 of the time people come up and say that they're on the list. There either isn't a list to begin with, or they're not on the list. <laughs> what fucking list? If you show me the list and you're on it, hell, I'll let you in. I might even buy you a couple of rounds. I want to see this fucking list. Don't drink on the line. For some reason, everyone thinks that New York is actually New Orleans. Don't push. You're going to get in. Our ice cubes ain't going to melt. Most of the bars and clubs I work for, they don't want you to come in looking like you just rolled out of bed. You are not getting inside with motherfucking sneakers. If you went to Foot Locker 20 minutes ago and they're fucking crispy as fuck, no sneakers, my man. I don't like sweatpants because it's not Netflix and chill. Like, you're literally going out to be a social person. The number one annoying thing that people wear is sunglasses. Why are you wearing sunglasses at night? We're open for Halloween. I want you to have a great time. Don't walk up to me with a full mask over your face and give me an ID and think that I am just going to trust that this is your face underneath that Darth Vader mask. If you show up to the club and you're in a Cinco de Mayo outfit and you're doing it in a way that seems like you're making fun of a particular culture, like you're not coming inside. I've had sombreros that are like stacked up to, to my knees. Spotting drunk people in the line is like a huge part of your job. We all know the world spins on its axis. Just because the earth is rotating doesn't mean that you need to walk to me doing pirouettes. Eye contact. I try to look at you and you're looking at the top of my forehead first and it slowly catches my eyes. Probably had a little too much to drink. People will try to get in the door with shit stains. If you smell like shit and got a shit stain, you're not coming in this bar. People will be wobbling, but they'll be like, it's it's I, it's because my feet hurt. They're like wearing sneakers. You pull Woody Woodpecker out, urinating my bar, you're going out the door. I think that we as a society don't understand how important security is. Realize that we are being paid to babysit you and that you are probably not easy to babysit, so be nice. Respect the door, man. We're all humans. Don't think that just because you see somebody working at nighttime, that that's all they are. Don't think that the bouncer is an idiot. He's probably more intelligent than you. <laughs>